All right, from here we're going to show how to actually start and get Screen Connect running on a Mac. First thing you need to do is open your browser, whether it's Safari or um, well, it's probably better to use Safari. Where are we? There we go. All right, so you put in the URL that's given by your support person and click start a session. Um, put in the user's name, right? And download app. Once you do that, it starts a download here. Now, we're going to wait for the download to complete. On PC, the file size is about 4 megs, less than 10 megs. Um, on the Mac, it's much larger, so it takes a little while to get done. So let's wait until that finishes. All right, so our download is now complete. We can run the support panel. Let us remove the old one. and click on your downloads and you click on the support client. When you do that, it asks you, app created by Safari, are you sure you want to open it? You click on open, All right? When you do that, you still have accessibility options that need to be set. The um, icon pops up right there, All right? The Screen Connect client is available. So now, at this point, we still need to go into our system preferences. We go into security and privacy again. And scroll down. Under screen recording, you need to ensure on the screen recording, you need to ensure that this is checked so that the screen will be visible. And under accessibility, you need to ensure that this is checked so that the person can gain access to the system. Once that is done, it will say you've successfully joined the session. And from there, the person providing you with support should be able to connect.